Hello Virgo, thank you for stopping by. This is Elizabeth. Uh, today I'm going to look into the message for this coming week for you as well. Take in what resonates and leave the rest. I'm going to use two different decks and both decks are shuffled already. But I'm going to do a lightly shuffling and see what the message uh, coming on the uh, first week of uh, message so you have three of swords you have some sense of uh, disappointment have a heartache or heart broken or uh, someone hurting you disappointed you not sincere to you so make sure you uh, reach out to whoever that can help you can comfort you and know that um, things happen for a reason and you will grow stronger from this situation, use it as a lesson learned. Notice that the sadness, achiness, and heartache will take time to heal. Um, you know, uh, uh, acknowledge your own sadness and move on when you can. So you have fire of sword coming into your. Um, reading as well so fire of sword just making sure that you understand you know who you are battering with okay so walk away from the situation or people who dishonest and um, not sincere to you it's not worth the uh, argument or uh, competition and then walk away if it worth it and make sure you fight for it okay so you realizing that you can um, you know do what you want and do what best for you make the best choice for yourself and your happiness if the friends or colleagues or companies or places you work with are not honest with you and constantly put you down, then you need just to just walk away and take your skill, take your friendship, something else. Making sure that you know if something else is not worth an effort, then don't do it. Don't waste your energy. If something else is worth your energy to save it, to battle for it and you should stand your ground and go for it you also have to work up if some of you who is looking for love two people are handing each other cup falling in love or making a serious commitment to one another you know forgive the past and the you know restoration of the problem don't give up, you know, make you sure that you walk forward. Your relationship can be healed from uh, time, uh, that take time to do that. For some of you, have someone come in and rescue you out from your sadness, your uh, bad situation. This person going to walk you, lead you to the place that you can feel comfortable, feel happy and feel worth it okay so let's take a look into the bottom of the deck you have the wheels wheels are turning for you things that you waiting uh, to uh, move forward now it is time going forward now no more delay the delays are over things moving forward is sudden or unexpected of your good luck charm or things that good uh, coming your way perhaps because the wheel some of you may have a new car because the wheel some of you may travel on the vacations or buy a brand new fancy vehicle for yourself okay things are moving forward things are not stuck and give you sadness and achy hearts anymore or you don't need to be fighting or compete with anyone for their attention for their for your worth anymore because i feel the two of cup whoever could be your friend or your lover or uh, someone that you um 
you know, you meet that going to be the person maybe lead you to a better path, to a better road of your journey this coming week. Let's take a look into the message of Angel of Abundance. See what you have here. You have, you need a quiet retreat for yourself. You're going to have aches and, uh, you know, a disappointment and deal with people that dishonest or maybe you the one that dishonest to yourself. You need to stop that. Okay. So now all of those emotional um, ups and downs, you're exhausted, you need a quiet retreat, time for you. It is time to, you know, disconnect uh, from the outer world so that you can uh, discern and process your true thoughts and feeling from your inner world now. Okay, so and... Uh, you know, uh, create the quiet retreat, a quiet spot, a vacation a spot or time for yourself and you will have more clarity about what you need to do next now. So make sure you take time for yourself. You know, when you in the quiet retreat, that is when you find out about your own deep soul what you really need to do. So make sure you take that opportunity to take care of yourself, Virgo. Take care.